Forecast with meteorologist Patrick Evans. You're looking at the downtown Palm Springs cam, looking out over Palm Canyon Drive. Folks out and about wearing hoodies and sweatshirts. It's chilly to start the day. We have areas of uh, temperatures below freezing, frost advisory in effect. Skies are clear, winds are fairly light. That allowed for a lot of radiational cooling in the overnight hours, which takes our temperatures down deep, and that's why the frost advisory up for the Inland Empire, stretching all the way through the uh, San Bernardino area, and then here in the Coachella Valley, and then down into San Diego County. Uh, this is the frost advisory that is in place for us, and it covers the entire valley. Valley will last until 8 o'clock this morning. And the numbers, well, they're indicative of a frosty morning. 41 degrees Palm Springs, 37 in Cathedral City and Desert Hot Springs. We're down below freezing in Indio, Thermal, and Mecca. We've got 33 up in 29 Palms and 27 in Yucca Valley. Look at this, 10 at Big Bear. And it's in the freezing range as you move through the pass as well. So all across the region, very chilly conditions to start our Monday and our work week. And you are looking at light breezes. Winds up around the 10 mile per hour mark. West Valley lighter than that in the East Valley with those lighter winds, cooler temperatures. Now we are talking about rain later this week as we head toward Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. I think the best chance is going to be Thursday. Uh, for the next couple days, fairly mild. Winter solstice tomorrow, we're going to see mostly sunny skies, but then late Wednesday, we start to pick up some cloud cover. I don't anticipate any showers for us even Wednesday night, but Thursday, we're going to see some rainfall in place around the region. This is light stuff. I'm not talking about a lot of rain, but the best chance for us is going to be Thursday. There's another system that moves in over the weekend, and so late Saturday into Sunday, we could see another round of showers. But in terms of the precip precipitation totals, we're looking at maybe a, a tenth of an inch, especially West Valley. East Valley will be seeing lighter rainfall totals than that. Uh, but it's something we need to be prepared for, particularly because Thursday is going to be a busy travel, travel day as folks get on the road to get out in time for Christmas. Temperatures in the upper 60s today. We're going to cool off toward the end of the week. When that storm comes in, you'll see the numbers dropping off. But the next couple of days, we're going to be in the upper 60s and low 70s. Chance of showers or light rain on Thursday and into Friday, and then showers developing again. Some rain in the overnight hours, uh, Christmas night, moving into Sunday. So just understand that travel may be a little more difficult because of the precipitation on the roads. Back with more after the break on News Channel 3. You're watching the Desert's News Leader.